Okay, hello everybody, and welcome back to Mass Effect 3, where I have sufficiently recovered to be able to move on with the rest of the game, I think. That woman has no legs. She's got boots, but no legs. I mean, I like, I like that there's so many injured, like, I mean, it's not good, but, like, I like the, the detail that there's so many injured that, like, you can't walk, you know, like, you have to go around, and... I'm pretty sure that those ones aren't dead, I'm pretty sure they would just leave them on the ground. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position to survive. If we take care of them first and ration our supplies, we can save some now and enable ourselves to save more later. We cannot do that. We swore an oath to help the sick regardless of their economic situations or their places in society. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. I don't know, ma'am. our patients, all of them. It's true, her, hers is actually the way you're supposed to do it. That's actually medical. I understand Palavin is very busy, but this is one of your own generals. He was stabbed with a poison blade by a Cerberus soldier during the attack on the Citadel. We can't identify the toxin. We're barely keeping him alive right now. It's some form of neurotoxin. If you could look at our charts. Of course, I understand. Even a general is just one man. Good luck. Is it Oraka? I don't know. It's good that Kolyat's with him. Kolyat was his family. Medical ship inbound from Thessia. Hospital is much more hectic now. There's got to be something. I don't know what Cerberus was packing, but we're going to lose this patient. Without a new treatment plan, we're stuck, and I can't think of anything beyond what we've already tried. I know, but I can't think of anything else. Can you? She just said she just said no. You're a Solarian. Do something. Sorry, I interrupted you. So you went back to the farm. We snuck down the hill. We were hungry, filthy. They'd turned the towel into a kind of tunic. They'd cleaned up the bodies to make more husks, I figured. But there were still farmers alive. They were being held prisoner. And Neira was there, directing the other forces. I could see her. I, I got within ten meters of her. What happened next? I got to the prisoners. The farm girl unlocked their restraints, and that's when they all started screaming. We're low on metagel and synthetic blood, and we don't have enough volunteers. If we could get the rings of a loon from the Salian Nebula, we could declare a cultural crisis. People would have to listen. No, they're not just symbolic. The Asari revere a loon. She wore these rings after learning medicine from a fame herself. She was like a Dalatress for your people. If we displayed her rings, we'd get more Asari support in the hospitals. But where do you throw your support at, you know? So many different places need it. Welcome to Serta. Yeah, oh, wow. Thank you for coming to Serta. How can we help you? That's getting more and more expensive, geez. Well, this one didn't make it. Spectre status recognized. 
Thanks. Uh, let's just uh, make the rounds, I guess. It's not as destroyed as it was when Sovereign attacked, but... It's still pretty messed up, Citadel. Not that these loading screens show you that. <clears throat> it's amazing how insecure the Citadel actually is. And how many people are cool with staying here even though we know that there's a... That this is basically like there's a conduit here for the Reapers, you know? Listen, I thought of something. No, it can't wait until I'm back on duty. The Hesperia period. Their statues had legendarily accurate Prothean inscriptions. Can we use that? Yes, I know the Athena Nebula is off limits, but this... A classified project. It needs all the Prothean intel we can find. I haven't found any reliable pictures, but just think. If those statues had something that could help us, even today. She's going around. It's my money, and I'm closing my account. Your account helps fund Citadel Defense. If you shut it down and hide the money under your bed, it hurts the war effort. And if Cerberus attacks again and takes the Citadel, my money is gone. I'll take my chances on my own. Thank you. So you're fleeing the Citadel? Running to Sanctuary? If you trust the Council, you'll stay here. Why should I trust them? They couldn't stop Cerberus. What could they possibly do about the Reapers? Nothing if you take your money and hide. Have you seen Palavin? Or Earth? You can't escape this war. At least here you've got the Council fighting for you. But to fight, they need money. Money this bank has loaned them using accounts like yours. Okay. Okay, damn it. Leave the account open. Besides, how can some place like Sanctuary promise more safety than the Citadel? You're right. I guess all we can do. I don't know. Sanctuary hasn't been breached yet, you know what I mean? Can I buy jellyfish yet? Welcome to Kanala Exports. Jellyfish! Cultivating serenity. Yay! We especially time. At least I can add the jellyfish. I love how people like investigating. It's like, yep, lots of people died. I can't believe how hard the doctors are working to keep that terrorist bastard alive. He's in intensive care? He got blasted by Cerberus. They think he's just another victim. Mm. Hmm. Mm. Eh? Mm. Map! Jeez. We can help this guy. How many this time? Clear the area until you've done a full sweep. We need a way to find our tech. You can have it. I have it. No, the crime still doesn't have anything. The tech they got off the bodies of a few Cerberus engineers self-destructed when they took it apart. That you guys know that. We can do, except pick up the pieces after another turret guns down on mom and her kids. That's cool, dude. These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have E-Crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. I try. Now we can access um, Cerberus or uh, Citadel defense on our war efforts. The scene contains large scorch marks. Looks like three fatalities. This entire area shot to hell. Precision shots. I heard the Geth use jamming towers to prevent auto-targeting. If we had tech like that, we might save some lives next time. Where's the R and her mom? Security vids bring me a warrant. You're stonewalling me? Those vids could be vital to the war effort. Hello, Solarian. They just I popped the in. I Reapers have agents doing business in my cafe. We're trying to protect you. Hell of a job you're doing. See those scorch marks? Cerberus killed one of my servers right there. Where were you? Hey, I lost friends too. If you care about finding the Cerberus informants who made it happen, you'll give me the vids. We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. 
Thank you. I have some high-profile customers. If word gets out that I'm ratting them out to CSEC, you think I care about insider trading or electronic smuggling right now? I'm after the bastards who attacked the Citadel. Nobody else. You've got my word on it. All right. Just... I hope it helps. No replacement. Niara, where are you? Where is everybody? Meridian Place Market? She's down there? Where's your mom also? Damn it. If we'd kept digging a few hours longer, we'd have gotten the obelisk of Karza. I know the Hades Nexus is off limits. I'm not an idiot. Damn it, the Alliance needs Everything's off now. limits. The Athena cluster. The other one, that one. Like the Rosetta Stone for Protheans. Think of how much it could have helped us understand. Me. This lady's important later. Welcome to the Citadel gift shop. All proceeds. People have a right to defend themselves. If you start selling weapons to everyone on the Citadel, CSEC will shut this whole place down. CSEC couldn't protect us when Cerberus attacked. I'll take him to court. You think a court is going to want more people running with guns right now? Then I'll go to the wards and sell from the back room at Purgatory. People are already scared. If you violate weapons laws, they'll just be scared and trigger happy. Would a bunch of civilians shooting at anything that moves make the Citadel safer? The commander's right. Maybe if the council organizes a civilian yes, militia... Yes, that one. I like that option. Otherwise, they'll just panic and get themselves killed. They don't know how to I use just... a gun. I just want people to be safe. I know, but second-guessing CSEC isn't the way. What if we submit a proposal to start a militia? Okay, that'd be something. That would be good. Oh, there she is. Hello, Shepard. That's it? Really? Nice to see you. Okay. Nice to see you, too. Commander well. Shepard, do you have a minute? Me? Hello. Can I help you? Jordan Knowles, E Crimes. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. I've got a saboteur hacking key systems, power, communications. It's bad. If you've got time to help, check out this console. Got it. Looks like a collection of access codes. They're Batarian diplomatic codes from back when they had an embassy on the Citadel. If you can use your Spectre access to find them, I can show you. Oh, them I down. remember this one. I can access restricted intel at the Spectre office in the Embassy. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Yep, that's just me, helping people out. We have to keep enforcing the law. Same as always. Without that, everything goes to hell. Look at Palavin, my friend. We're in hell. We should be looking for terrorists. The rest can take care of itself. So the bar fights, the drunken disorderlies down by that purgatory place? How does cracking down on that crap help us win the war? People need to blow off steam right now. And how does letting the misdemeanors go help the war? Less time spent on the light stuff means the Citadel has more money for defense. I can't remember who I supported last time, but it was a bad idea. I think I supported... I might have supported the angry one, but I can't remember. I won't worry about it right now. I just don't understand why you're suddenly so conflicted. Look, the asshole's in custody now. Killing him won't bring anyone back. It's about justice. The man is a traitor and a murderer. You saw what he did to your wife. To my husband. And didn't bat an eyelash. He's evil, there's no doubt. What's going on here? I'm in position at CSEC. Draw them away and I'll move in and make the kill. Don't answer that. Huh? What? Um, citizens of the Citadel all are prepared to carry out some sort of assassination at the CSEC office in the Presidium Commons. Go there and look for suspicious activity. Okay, right here. Yeah. 
Hello, guy. Commander Shepard. Guess I know what happened to my backup. Excuse me? Come on. I'm in C-Sec in civilian gear with a weapon. I know what I'm made. Just let me explain. Captain Aaron Summers, Alliance Marines, retired. Captain Summers? There was a prisoner here. C-Sec officer who helped Cerberus. C-Sec caught him when you stopped the coup. Now he's offering them intel on Cerberus to get a better deal. Why are you telling me this? Hmm. Because he doesn't deserve a better deal. He killed people during the coup, good people. And he's former Alliance, like us. The way I figure it, he's our problem to fix. If you gun that man down, you're dishonoring the uniform just as much as he did. Like hell I am. I don't like plea bargains any more than you do. But the intel we get will save lives. Says who? Our superiors. The people we swore to serve and trust. Captain Summers. Yes, Commander. Sorry, Commander. I'll shut it down. Thanks. I know it's hard. But we really do need the intel. I think I actually helped. I think I did the, um... The patient one. The so I'm gonna do the angry one this time. So the bar fights, the drunken disorderlies down by that purgatory. Everyone on the Citadel knows we're at war now. Cerberus caught C sec by surprise. Oh crap, last it was time. Renegade! You need to make sure that never happens again. That's what I'm saying. Forget the small stuff. Support defense and security and take down anyone who threatens the peace. You make it sound like we're under martial law. After a coup attempt during wartime, maybe we should be. Whoop. I don't know. I think it's a good idea to focus on the big things, but to still leave a little bit for the little things, you know? But you do what you can. You just do what you can. It's difficult. I don't think there's actually anything back here anymore. It's like used for like one, two things, I think. Two things in that. Yeah. So we went to. Let's go to Purgatory. I think if we go back to our ship, we get Caden back after this. Don't know if I'll bring him out much, but it'll be nice to have more people on the ship. I think last time I did the combat simulator, I brought him and Liara once just for kicks, and actually they were a pretty powerful combination. You do not understand. The code of the ancients is the collected wisdom of our people. With overwhelming sadness, it was lost when... I just have a hard time believing people don't have copies of these things, you know? How's the head? Good. Concussion's almost gone. Good. When I heard you were injured. It was stupid. I should have ducked when that wall came down. Something good has come out of all this, though. Got new equipment. Sent me a set of Vortex armor. Man, summoning supplies sure messed that one up. Oh, I've heard those are pretty good. It's great. It'd only be safer inside a tank. It's why Vortex gear costs more than I make in a year. Uh-huh. Everybody good? Everybody good? Nothing new for me here? Oh, did we not get to finish the, uh, the Alliance personnel conversation? It turns into a funny thing. Oh, it's Jack! Jack, I forgot you were here! Ugh, this sucks. What have you got there? Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They've got us spread out across Alliance units. Reinforcing barriers, modding ammo, that kind of thing. How are they holding up? They are fine. They're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore leave. <laughs> Complain if you like, but I think military life suits you. Hey, running back to the Alliance was your lifelong dream, not mine. Come on. <laughs> combat, free room and board, and people you can depend on. Yeah, yeah. 
Maybe your little suicide squad <laughs> something about teamwork. Speaking of which, thanks. My guys are handling the support stuff well. Still see some action, but they're not on the front lines. They've saved a lot of lives. It'd be a hell of a lot more fun with you. You find bigger fights. But the little shits are useless with Jack, you. I really could use I the, the powers them. that you are advertised with. Now, apparently. I blame you for this, Shepard. I know. I'm the worst. My bad. Come on. What? We're we gonna go dancing? The duty rosters can wait. Right now, you're on shore leave. We're gonna go dancing! We're gonna go dancing! And then we could use, Shepard could use a break after what happened. <laughs> Shepard, everybody knows you can't dance. Can too. Shepard just, she tries her best, you know? I think it's funny that they made that inside, little inside joke from fans into an actual thing in the game. Edie! technology to help protect the central processing unit in the head. If the skin is struck or shot, it solidifies to absorb the impact. It also is capable of limited self-healing. And what about the hair? It is of similar construction. For defense, I have set it to cohere into a solid piece. However, for infiltration purposes, <laughs> it can be parted into individual strands. If it has recently been exposed to water, I generally can't do a thing with it. <laughs> Oh my gosh. If I'm not needed to answer an inquiry, I would like some time alone. What is going on? What's going on with you, Edie? Um. Oh, is James still? No, the Joker! Joker! Look at this. All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war. How's this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing. <laughs> forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. <laughs> if a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. <laughs> That's surprisingly observant. <laughs> I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? Watching from the sidelines. <laughs> what do you think about me and he? <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> sure. Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over the clothes action? That's eh, always a risk. But then so are the Reapers. Yeah, Shepard's like, ah! <laughs> You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Aw, Joker. Such a stupid idea. If you could be out there right now on the dance floor... Would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Haha. <laughs> yeah, guess I do. Now, if you'll excuse me. Is he gonna go dance with Edie? Hey, hold up, hold up, I gotta go see. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Haven't broken anything yet. That's a start. <laughs> See, Joker? What's why why in the Citadel DLC is y'all like, I don't wanna dance, but he's just he's going crazy up there and Edie's like not moving at all. She's probably just shocked. Shocked, stunned and amazed. You guys gonna talk? Good talk, good talk, no? Picking up a lot more quests this time around. We'll go to the embassies last because there's I can go to the Spectre office and do some stuff in there. Oh, 
what I don't like is that the game the game itself doesn't really explain Udina's actions in content like in the game. But you, you get a codex entry where basically it says that he was trying to save Earth. He was trying he he was frustrated by the lack of help from the other species in on the council and he got fed up with it and made a deal with the elusive man so that hope he, he could take over the Citadel fleets and use them to free Earth. And apparently he was also hoping he could outmaneuver the elusive man and have full control of the fleets. So he was a he was a desperate man. The galaxy needs to understand what these refugees have been through. Can't you let me in? No. I only need a couple of hours of footage. You're not crossing that dock. Wait, aren't you Commander Shepard? Solik Vaz, documentary maker. Please, maybe you can help. I'm trying to document the stories of the refugees coming to the Citadel. Their loss, their sacrifices, their moments of bravery. Something holding you back? CSEC won't allow me on the docks. They say I'd be disruptive, but you could catch a few quick shots for me. There are lots of refugees on the rest of the Citadel. It won't have the same impact as seeing crowds trapped on the docks. We all need to help each other. I want this documentary to shock people into action. Good idea. The galaxy should see what these refugees have been through. Thank you, Commander. That's exactly what I'm hoping for. I was a bit suspicious a of him. Omni tool in the refugee camp. I'll be here when you're done. I was like, is he gonna try and do something else with it? But he's not. I'm pretty sure. Yes, that's just what this documentary needs. There's so many more people here now. I don't think that will quite fit the documentary's tone. What the seasick? Uh. I can't really use that. Could you try again, My game is like dropping frame rates, it seems like. Great shot, Commander. A Batarian and a human chatting it up. What are you doing here? I'm waiting. Waiting? Waiting for who? Oh, for my parents. They put me on the rescue transport and said to wait for them here. They'll come find me as soon as they can. Well. I guess this is a statement to raise keys during an evacuation. Look, if anyone bothers you, let me know. I'll take care of them, okay? Sure thing, sir. Thanks. Oh, that story is just so sad. I'm sorry, but that's not quite what I had in mind. Let's see. Mm-hmm. I believe those are my James! Friends. Asari comforting. So we see more because before I don't think we saw any Asari down here, but we definitely see more now. Son of a bitch. Having fun? Oh, that's like the. Excellent. That will really get people's attention. Thank you, Commander. James, enjoying yourself? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Try not to lose everything. Those clothes are Alliance property. Have a little faith, Lola. <laughs> I have a little. <laughs> I think. Listen, please, we just need more food. I can give you the location of some ruins. Prothean ruins on Gay Hinnom in the Hades Nexus. If you could get past the Reaper patrols, I'm sure you'd find something valuable. Pretty That's sure the, uh. Please, my family is starving. The. Batarian codes lead over there. Hey, I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving Kay. forward with Ari. Good, good. Did I get all the photo opportunities? Ooh, cool armor guy. Right, there's that one too. Pressure's okay. No infection so far. Can I talk to him? Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Take down the sedative a bit, but hurry. I peg his survival at 50-50. Are you Gorek? <sighs> Go away. Nothing to say. Not even what a terrorist's doing on the Citadel? You! 
Do I know you? <coughs> Every Batarian with someone on Eratok remembers your face. Ah, this makes more sense now. Planet that got caught in the Alpha Relay explosion. You butcher the colony while they regret. <coughs> Don't have the strength to. I destroyed Eratot's relay to stop the Reapers from pouring through. <coughs> Easy for you to claim now that they're here. Don't pretend you have any remorse. You think I didn't feel guilty? I destroyed a colony. I've thought about the people who died, about how I couldn't warn them in time. In the end, I didn't have a choice. But I'm sorry, if that means anything. <laughs> if you're so remorseful... <coughs> do you have any real guilt? Show some mercy. <laughs> Unplug this machine. Let me join my family. Makes more sense now than the last time I did it. Did I get enough pictures for you guy? I kind of cut you off, I think. I have your footage. Thank you, Commander. Okay, good. I'll start editing it right away. Sweet deal. And then we go. Destination. Let's go to the Citadel embassies. One moment, please. I think the floors keep changing. I think Purgatory was on the bottom last time. I don't know, maybe not. That'd be weird, though. The floors aren't supposed to change. <laughs> My goal is to get what I can from the Citadel, and then we'll go get Caden. Tip tree. Just this one. Look, I filled out all the forms you requested and jumped through every hoop. I don't even know where Neota is, and I'm gonna be deployed soon, too. Everyone's been called back to active duty since Earth was attacked. I understand, but I can't leave my daughter here alone. I need to send her back to Thessia, to her family. These things are very complicated and usually take a very long time. It's even worse with everything going on right now. I'm very sorry. If you can't accept a fostering by proxy until her file is processed, there's nothing more I can do. I'm not really sure why. It's so complicated, but you can go talk to Bailey. Oh, there's something over here too, I think. This is a problem, boss. Cerberus has changed their cipher. Yep. Our code breakers aren't getting anywhere at the moment. I've got our best teams working in shifts on it. But ensuring Citadel system's integrity is just going to take time. If we can get encryption tools, maybe sample ciphers. I understand. I like that everybody has a name. Not just like Turian officer or something, you know? Lots of stuff. Is... Okay, I can enable that. Let's find evidence that would incorporate. They've tapped public surveillance fees. We don't have legal access to access private ones. Without informing civilian agencies. It's kind of a tricky thing to do, but it's going to help. Financial reports for top level MC access only. 
The Citadel races cannot sustain the cost of the war for more than one year, although much is spending estimated in certain market sectors, orders and rationing in other areas of the first financial system. Civilian discretionary spending has fallen into entertainment areas like escapist bids and drinking. First, Irun is borrowing heavily to provide funds for key functions across Citadel, but if the war does not end within the next year, the galactic financial collapse is inevitable. Yay, they filled a request for civilian militia! Oh yeah, using funds normally allocated to executive bonuses? Frick yeah, enable that. Jeez. Alright. Spectre requisition. I don't think I can afford any of them, <laughs> but... Oh, cool. Ew. Power recharge speed. Tempting. Usually by the end of the game, I'm rolling in the credits, but... We'll see. Can't get into Udina's office anymore. Boop -de boop. Let's check on Bailey. Wow, Bailey, your clothes just came together. Uh, so many pieces to put back together since the Cerberus attack. We're reeling from the implications. Udina in league with Cerberus trying to murder the Council. These are dark days for all of us. Thought you'd be in the hospital. If I'm breathing, I'm working. Probably the worst I've ever been hurt. Fitting, I guess, given the state of the galaxy. But if Cerberus thinks a few slugs is gonna keep me out of action, they've got Bailey's another a thing Bailey's a tough coming. old boy. Can this station be defended? The internal security breaches have been patched, but we're dangerously low on manpower. We're grilling our own people and trying to figure out if Udina acted alone, but it's time-consuming. All in all, we're still vulnerable, but I think we've taken the right steps. I trust Bailey. All that time you were working for Udina, did you ever suspect? Always rubbed me a little wrong. Still, that traitorous bastard upped me. Probably made me for an idiot. <laughs> I guess I proved him right. He's dead and you're still here, Bailey. <laughs> Thanks to you. If you hadn't shown up, Udina and Cerberus would be dancing on my grave. So he's like the highest rated, I think, human on the Citadel right now, probably. How does the Citadel fit into the war now? Uh, the war finally found us. This is so far beyond our imagination, and we have been trained to expect the unexpected. You can't do that, though. You can't Since expect the, the unexpected. Since the coup attempt, folks are shutting down and shutting in. I hear a lot of praying and crying. They're saying this is the war to end all wars. Well, I haven't seen anything to say they aren't right. No time for rest. Good luck, Bailey. Yeah. You too, Shepard. It is the war to end all wars. Pretty much. Pretty much. That's exactly what it is. You... Nope. Okay. Whoa. My game seems to be acting up a bit. To the Normandy! My one constant in this ever-changing galaxy. Well, actually, she's not. <laughs> this is the second iteration of her. <laughs> but I always have a Normandy. And I always have a Garrus, so that's nice. We'll see if I'm correct about getting Caden on this one. Now arriving at docking bay D24. There might be... I've got your briefing, Private. Let's fill you in before the squad arrives. The Alliance is posting us to an Ezo mining facility on Zani. It's a low-gravity planet. Toxic atmosphere. You'll be expected to maintain full survival gear. Any questions? Are we playing security, Sergeant OMB? No, Private. We are not. Mm, no, Private. I like her armor. Indeed he did. Security at Sonax, and there was definitely Prothean tech on Garvug. I know the Valhalla threshold is Reaper territory now, but Prothean tech could help the crucible. Huh. Wow. Yes. Reaper. Yes, ma'am. Yes, I'm aware this is an unsecured channel. Ye yes, understood. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> All right. Oh. Hey, what are you doing inside my ship already? Hey, I wondered where you went. What's up? 
I'm trying to wrap my head around what just happened. You sound angry. No, just not used to staring down the gun of someone I've worked with so closely. I went on one down, and it's got me... I don't know. Okay. Talk to me. Let's have it. If I hadn't backed down first, I feel like you would have taken me out. I trusted you, and I knew you'd come around. That's all that matters. Main thing is we stopped the coup and Cerberus is off the Citadel. Yeah, but sometimes the way a thing goes down does matter, Shepard. Later when you have to live with yourself. Knowing that you acted with integrity. But it matters. You're talking about Udina. You think he would have come in quietly? Caden, he gave you no choice. You had to take the shot. You acted with integrity. I saw the whole thing. All right. Thanks. Look, Shepard, there's, uh, there's another reason I'm here. Hackett offered me a position, but I'd turn it down in a second if there was a chance to join you in the Normandy again. I can't not have people on the ship, you know, so... Couldn't imagine meeting the Reapers without you. <sighs> Thank you, Commander. And Shepard, I need you to know that I'll never doubt you again. I get your back. Good to know. Welcome aboard, Major. Aye, aye, ma'am. It's good to have him back. It really is. Last time I was unsure if I was going to re reinstigate something with Caden. Took me a very long time through the game to realize I just couldn't do it. Like, I kept putting it off, putting it off, putting it off. But then when he tries to call you out for cheating, I just wanted to punch him in the face. But you don't get a chance to call him out on that, really. I thought that was lame. So, yeah. I didn't cheat. <coughs> Shepard, I got Anderson patched in. I was just getting him up to speed. Udina. That SOB was always power hungry. But this? He wasn't in charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the <laughs> Anderson's city. only a personal... What the hell for? <laughs> I don't know. Not yet. Could have been a lot worse. Shepard stopped the assassination attempt on Counselor Valorn. Kyle mm. What? Your assassin. I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. I take it you two have met. Kaylee Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. It's in the book. I shot him in both legs once. Thought that might be the end the of it. The second book or the third but one? But he should have begun on Omega, even stronger. Elusive man patch him up? That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson. Grayson's the guy, yeah, yeah. It's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. I'll take whatever advantage I can get against these bastards. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. I received word from the Asari counselor. They're requesting an update on the Crucible. Yeah, now. Lang has them scared. Enough to send help? Mm. Yes, the Asari and Solarians are both. Yep. Their so curing the genophage is the How's best thing you can do. Crucible? Good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly fifty percent of the known work. So quickly. Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. It's not Prothean specific. Hmm. Hmm. Are we any closer hmm. to understanding how hmm. to use it? That's still open hmm. for debate. Hmm. Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. The question is, how will it dispense the energy, and in what form? You mean, how do you stop it from wiping us all out? Exactly. We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus its energy, how to direct its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. You'll find the answer, Shepard. Yeah, no I'll pressure. Send you an update on the schematics. And in the meantime, we'll keep building. And we'll keep fighting. Make sure there's an Earth left to come back to. You've always trusted me. I won't let you down. We're still no ahead. pressure! The gods of war haven't given up on us yet. Good luck, both of you. Anderson out. Commander, the Turian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships. Oh, now, now we can go talk to the Quarians. Understood, sir. I'll look into it. Be careful. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. We can get Tally back! Shepard, do you have a moment? A contact within Asari High Command was insistent I pass <gasps> on the distress Ooh, we can go talk to Samara now! Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. 
None of them returned. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. What's your take on Why this? Why me? That they wouldn't ask for help if it wasn't important. Why me? The colony's coordinates are on the galaxy map. I'll try to figure out what's going on. Well, let's look at this. Ah, don't know what alien. The Citadel Defense Force. Come on. Mm, the Council created the Citadel Defense Force. Poor Shepard and the War. Gets the Reaper. Compliments from a few species of official membership status have also quietly joined. After Sims coup. An increase in refugees and the depleted resource. Depleted resources. Uh. Depleted resources that might have otherwise gone to defense systems personnel. Civilians volunteering at emergency clinics help to save lives by processing patients. Warning people in the Citadel to prepare for the war has improved civilian readiness. Commander Shepard restored duty pay to spouses and family of active service people, improving morale in the Citadel. Connors exploiting refugees thrown off the Citadel. Uh, improving security with the permission to tap into private citizen surveillance. Trained to do the civilian militia. Housing was found for students. The gifted teenagers have been helping, however, by dealing with any repetitive problems that can't be delegated to VIs. Wait, no, no, I didn't. I said, I said, focus on the big crimes. Didn't I? I totally clicked on the angry one. No, I, no, I, that's wrong. They are making donations to relief efforts. Schematics have helped shut down turrets. Schematics of advanced biotic amplifiers from Griffin Griffin. Good. Lions. <clears throat> boop, 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 boop. Oh, who was it? I didn't couldn't see it. Mineral resources? No. Sumi go to Oh, is it? No, it's not Jack. Jack's already been there. I don't know. Oops. Oh, wow. Sorry, Science Team, Sorry, Seconds Fleet, Sorry, Sixth Fleet, and the Destiny Ascension. Yay! Save that, at least. Now that the Asari are finally in the fight. Krogan Clans. Yep, yep. Oh, right. Okay. Which drew even more of the clans to the Allied Forces banner. Nice. Solarian, Solarian Third Fleet. Well, they their firepower is comparable to any other major major naval force. Nice, Torian Sixth Fleet. Yay! Now it's ready to fly to areas to help fight off the invasion. Excellent, we're doing very well. We will definitely have this maxed out. And there's the crucible, fifty percent done. But anyway, this one's been going on for a long time. Probably make it one whole one, but we'll see. Um, but thank you guys for your support. We had to run around the citadel, just you know, picking up all the new questy items that we can pick up. So now there's a whole lot more side questing for us to do. But we might go grab Tally as soon as we can, just because it'd be nice to have Tally back on the ship. So um, even though that does forward main mission stuff pretty fast. But it, we should be fine. It should be all right. But anyway, thank you guys again for joining me. I appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying this far. And I'll see you in the next one.